Hey, what's up guys? Growing the Hobby coming back to you guys with another boom box break here. Part of the boom box break week. Uh, today we're going to be doing another baseball break. Today we're going to feature the May version of high-end baseball uh, from the boom box. This is the $60, well $59.99 technically, uh, $60 though version of uh, the boom box in the baseball series. Um Going to hope for some good packs and stuff like that. But before we get all into that, let's fill in the background really quick, guys. Uh, with no rhyme or reason, just wanted to feature a couple of different cards from the old PC. Uh, I figured I'd feature some of the cards I pulled uh, personally out of some of the Topps uh, Holiday uh, from 2019, just a few months ago here. Uh, right off the bat, I pulled the Vladdy uh, Guerrero Jr. Rookie, the photo variation there, the holiday photo variation with the old candy canes there you see instead of a bat. That is a pretty cool. Uh, I pulled an Aaron Judge. May look uh, normal to most people and stuff like that. May not pop, but if you guys can see the code down here without getting too much into it, you see that 084. I believe that's 85 or is that 65? Uh, yeah, it's an 85. Oh, sorry guys. 85, 65, whatever. Just take my word for it. This is a super short print. So it's not just the short print uh, or variation or anything like that. This is a super short print. Uh, it actually has a Beckett high value of close to $100. Um, so that is a good card. I didn't even realize it when I pulled it. In center stage, I have several of these, but you guys know from my PC or at least some of my baseball videos by now, my biggest player that I collect is the Polar Bear Pete Alonzo. So here is one of his, uh, this is just a base card, uh, but it's his base rookie uh, from the Topps Holiday uh, box. I have several of these. It's all sleeved up because we're going to send most of these off to PSA uh, to get some graded stuff. Uh, but anyway, that's for the background. Um, and what I will tell you guys too, uh, if you didn't notice in my platinum video that I've already posted, check that out if you haven't uh, for the May version. But anyway, the trying some different things here with the lighting, the background, things like that to try and keep uh, cards clear for you guys because that's the main thing what this is about. Um, this backdrop may not work for the clarity of the cards. So if it doesn't, I will pull the background cards. Uh, that seemed to clear it right up in the last video with the platinum baseball. Um, so if it just is too busy and the camera doesn't want to focus on the actual cards and it just focuses on the background cards, I'll just pull those and we'll get clarity right away, guys. Um, uh, but anyway, let's get into this, our high-end baseball. Um, looking forward to see what's in here. I actually, I always purposely try not to look, uh, when I'm wearing the boom boxes each month, I like to be surprised, uh, what packs I'm getting in and stuff like that. I mean, if you are on their site, they will show you the guaranteed packs and then they always throw in some bonus packs. Um, but, uh, I'm get rid of these packing peanuts, but, uh, I personally like to just be surprised each and every time. Um, so when I open it, I kind of learn with you guys what is in this month's boom box. Uh, and if you didn't check out again, my platinum, uh, break, which is another $40 more than this box cost, uh, check that out. I did get some cool packs in there. The most expensive was the 2020 tops tribute. Um, and some of the throw in ones were actually really cool. Another Gypsy Queen from 2020, the box topper with the chrome cards. And then what was really cool from 2019 Heritage, um, I, I don't know if you call it a box topper or what, but it's uh, it was a pack that had one original 1970 Heritage card from Tops in it. So that was kind of cool too. But anyway, here's our, our packs. I'm going to pull these out for you guys, set that here. It looks like we have, unfortunately, some 2019 Heritage low number I see in there. That's going to be a bonus pack. But uh, anyway, here's our one touch. I'll say what's different about this, guys. Uh, so this is a 75.1 touch there. That's different because the, um, and that's fine with me, but the uh, the Platinum gave a 55.1 touch, and I think that we normally get 55.1, so that 75 is a little bit bigger. Um, you guys can see it's just literature. Unfortunately, I did not pull one of the tickets. Uh, they put these ticket promos in here, and so you guys can see this. Before we review the packs, let's just show you. The ticket promo for the month, so they're now inserting these into Platinum as well. They're doing 10 tickets, randomly inserted in Platinum, 10 in the high-end baseball, which this product is here for a total of 20 tickets. If you pull one of these random tickets, uh, the top prizes this month, the Stan Musial and uh, Jim Tomey autographed bats and the Chipper Jones autographed jersey. The other 17 ticket holders uh, are guaranteed a prize also, which is always cool. I've yet to pull, again, in the dozens of these boxes I've bought. 
Never pulled a ticket. Um, hoping to pull one of those eventually here. But uh, anyway, that's what the ticket promo is about. Um, but you guys saw I did not pull that. Here is their social media, their contact stuff if you guys are interested in it. And then here is your May uh, lineup. So 2019 Bowman's Best is going to be roughly the best pack in here. With your They, they have your hit odds there again. Uh, your best chance for a hit, 1 in 3. 2019 Bowman Chrome, uh, it's going to be 1 in 6. And then we got 2018 Tops Chrome and 2020 Gypsy Queen. Uh, those are both 1 in 12. Then we got some bonus packs, which I could just tell from the side looking at. We have uh, 2019, and it looks like Heritage Low Number. Uh, but let's just see what we have here. So here is our 2020 Heritage. Uh, that is not guaranteed, so that's a bonus. Uh, these are all hobby packs. Again, guys, they do hobby only in these, uh, so that's always good. Good and a plus. Uh, so there's our 2020 Gypsy Queen. That was one of the guaranteed ones. Uh, here's our Bowman's Best. That was guaranteed. That's probably the best pack of the uh, the box. Uh, there is our 2019 Bowman Chrome. Second to best uh, pack in this box, in my opinion. 2018 uh, Tops Chrome. And that takes care of our guaranteed packs. And then there we go, our 2019, yes, uh, Heritage Alone number there. Unfortunately, nothing really great that you're going to pull in there unless you pull like an autograph or something like that. So we'll probably start with this. We'll do the 2020 Heritage after and stuff. We'll save the better packs for the end. Um, but anyway, we'll get into this, guys, and hopefully have a little bit of pack luck. We have a total of six packs. Uh, hopefully we get at least one autograph out of this, guys. That's kind of always my goal is to get one really nice autograph. Um, or actually any autograph, really. Um, and if I don't get an autograph, it'd be great to at least get a, um, uh, a you know, really like low number parallel rookie or something like that. Uh, but anyway, this is our 2019 Heritage. And honestly, I well, that's clear right now. If that, if that blurs up and doesn't focus, I'm going to pull those background cards for you guys. But anyway... Uh, the best rookie you can probably get in the low number uh, for 2019 is probably your Jeff McNeil uh, rookie for the Mets. Uh, the, the great rookie class is all pretty much in the high uh, series for 2019 Heritage. But anyway, let's see what we get here. I'm not going to look for short prints and stuff like that. I'll do that after. If you guys see one, feel free to leave it in the comments to tell me if I didn't catch it. But I do double check after the video. Uh, so we got Blake Parker, Chris Davis. Hopefully he has a bounce back here. Uh, we got a Reds rookie stars there with Blake Tran and uh, Jesus Reyes. Uh, there we go. American Top 40 News flashbacks. That's a kind of a different card. I haven't pulled many of those. American Top 40 hits the airways. Uh, NLCS Game 2, one of the highlights. We got a Mookie Betts, uh, Sporting News, Saved by the Bell, and a Jose Altuve, Sporting News. So really nothing stupendous out of that pack. Um, at least that I really noticed, guys. Uh, again, I'll check these after for myself. Uh, all right, 2020 Heritage. I have seen some decent cards. I'm not normally a fan of Heritage, but I have seen some decent ones out of 2020. Hopefully we get a little bit of luck here, maybe pull a nice rookie um, or autograph. The autographs are kind of hard to pull out of here, but uh, we got Whit Merrifield, Ian Kennedy, uh, G-Man Choi, Chris Sale. Ross Stripling, uh, some rookies there for your uh, Colorado Rockies. Nothing stupendous, though. Hector Neris, uh, one of the highlights cards there, and a Chad Pinder. So really nothing uh, stupendous or amazing out of that pack either. That's okay, though. I didn't really expect it. Let's do our 2020 Gypsy Queen. We're into our guaranteed packs now out of the high-end uh, baseball for the month of May. So these last four packs are all the guaranteed ones for the month. Uh, here we go. Mike Gostromski to start off. Uh, you see old Goriel, Kevin Newman. Let's see if we get something good. So we got an exit. That's different. Uh, Raldis Chapman there. There's Mike Rondell. JB there. Josh Bell. And... Okay, nothing nothing stupendous there, no autograph and stuff, but that's okay, guys. Like I said, here we go. These are the three packs I'm actually looking forward to the most. Uh, we're going to do these in order of what I think are our best chances of pulling something. So we're going to start with 2018 Topps Chrome. Uh, you guys obviously know Shohei being featured there as one of our rookies. We're definitely looking for um, 
but there is a nice rookie class in the 20 team. But you only get four cards in here. Let's see if we get lucky enough to get a a hit. Uh, Andrew Benatendi, Frank Elendor, Mr. Smiles, uh, Luis Castillo. And then we got a uh, Refractor. I think it's one of the throwback cards, though. Probably nothing to autograph, but... Yeah, Clayton Kershaw. Yeah, still. It is a... Uh, I don't, actually, it's not even a Refractor. I think these are all... Uh, that way, yeah, it's not number or anything like that. Those throwback anniversary cards are all kind of refractor looking like that. So nothing amazing out of that. I haven't had too much luck with the 2018 uh, Chrome. But anyway, here we go. 2019 Bowman Chrome. Uh, these last two packs are definitely the ones I'm really looking forward to. Um, and if you guys did not check out, uh, again, my platinum break of this boombox for the month, check that out because this pack was absolutely insane what I pulled out of the five cards. Four of the five cards were, like, just awesome uh, in the pack that I had in that uh, Platinum Boom Box. Uh, let's see if we have the same kind of luck, hopefully, here. I really hope so. Um, at least an autograph or something I would definitely make my day. Um, and we may, we may, we may. Let's get the... Oh, come on. Focus, focus, focus. Yeah, you know what, guys? Let me pull the background cards real quick for you. Because we're getting into the packs that really matters now, and I don't want this to come out of focus at just the wrong moment. All right. There we go. You see that center card, if you guys can see, it's a little bit different. Maybe tough to tell in the light, but that is what normally an autograph card looks like. So there's a very good chance, uh, if it's not an autograph, it's at least a nice parallel, hopefully. Um, there we go. We'll try and do that at the very end. But anyway, let's hope for some luck. Here we go. Jake DeGrom is our first card. Loris Goriel Jr. Uh, follows that up. Uh, Nick Madrigal. Let's see our next card. Sixto Sanchez. I'm surprised no, uh, no first Bowman cards uh, in this pack, but hopefully that's okay. They're saving our big one for right after here. Let's see what we got. It looks like... It is a parallel. Hopefully it's an autograph parallel to make it even better. It looks like purple. Okay, you guys know I'd like to do like a band-aid. No slow reveals. Let's just pull it. One, two. Boom. Okay. Eh, no autograph, but it's still... It is a parallel. That's pretty cool. It is a Shervin Newton. It is a first Bowman. So that's good for the Mets. Um, and you guys can see here the back of the card. He was signed in 2015 as a free agent. Um, and I'll be darned. I thought that these were numbered. This is not numbered. Um, and you guys will have to forgive me. I don't remember the exact name of this one, uh, other than purple. That kind of little shimmer and stuff like that in the center. I'm not really sure the exact name of this. Uh, I have to check into that after. But again, that's, I was not expecting to not have numbering there, but all right. Still cool. It's a parallel card. I'll take it. It's better than just like a base pack or something like that or a silly insert. So that's cool. And it is a first Bowman. All right, guys. Our last chance at an autograph and our best chance at that. Uh, one in three chance here for Bowman's best. Uh, 2019. Five trading cards. If memory serves me correctly, the autograph card is going to be the uh, fourth one down. You know, second card from last. And the last card is always normally a refractor. Um, so we'll see and hopefully have a little bit of luck. Uh in each of the mini boxes, you get like a master box here, um, which has two autographs in each mini, or I'm sorry, two autographs total, one autograph in each mini box. So that's kind of where they're pulling this from. Um, and there's really no way I know, and I don't think there are any, uh, they're not thicker or anything like that, uh, but they're normally not either, because they're always on card autographs and stuff like that. So anyway, so we got Josh Beller, JB, right off the bat. Michael Kopech, that's uh, one of the decent rookies for years, probably one of your better pitchers. For sure. So nice Michael Kopech, uh, a rookie. Oh, nice. Keston Hero. That's a nice uh, rookie for sure. Very undervalued. His cards are definitely starting to head upward. And we're going to try to go right to the last card, which we know is a um, refractor. And it's, oh, there we go, guys. Sorry. That is a refractor of Jared uh, Kalonic. And where our autograph would be, whatever the hit is for the pack, it's going to be this next card, and this is our final card of the break. Cross your fingers, one, two. Oh, okay. Hey, still. Good player. Um, it's one of the franchise favorites, uh, Ronald Cunha Jr. Unfortunately, it's not going to be numbered, because uh, they do these in numbered versions as well. 
I wish this was mainly from like a 2018 where it's his rookie, but uh, it's still it's a good player and stuff like that. Cool card. Uh, unfortunately, no autographs today, guys. Uh, no autographs, um, but still some cool cards from the break. Um, if you guys didn't check out again, I know I, I sound like a broken record now, but uh, my platinum break, uh, my platinum was much better in my opinion, but again, it did cost $40 more. Um, but if I had to choose between the two, at least for this month and the pack look I've had, I would definitely spend the $40 more uh, in the case of this month uh, to get the the platinum box because I, I did have a lot of pack luck, but also uh, better packs overall too. So anyway, guys, uh, please like, subscribe, and share. Uh, stay tuned for many more boombox breaks uh, to still continue on this channel as well as other breaks for sure. High-end stuff coming. Um and also, if you guys didn't check out my other videos where I make my own boombox, please check that out. I did a baseball version and a hockey version, some really insane hits out of those. And I actually did that all over again. I have uh, tons of more packs coming in. I'm going to create my own baseball and my own hockey boombox again. So there will be new videos of that coming up here in the very near future. Um, and also, I think we're going to finally come around to breaking some 2011 Tops update. I have a box of that right now. We're going to break that on here uh, for definitely a special day, going trout fishing, if you will, for the Mike Trout uh, uh, rookie uh, in the update there. But anyway, guys, again, like, subscribe, and share, please. It goes a long way with helping the channel grow uh, and helping me bring you guys more great content. Hope you guys are staying safe. Have a great day, a great night, wherever you guys are at, and we'll see you guys next time. Take care.